Rewind St. Lunatics. You see me. I don't care if you're looking or not, man. Lunatics for life, man. This is Breaking Records Radio. Hey, yo, hey, yo. It's your boy Monster Man Rocco. It's your boy Swagger Rock. This is Snack Ripper. And you have to go to don't know. Master Ace. You are not rocking with the best. Breaking Records Radio. Breaking Records, man. Breaking Records Radio. Breaking Records Radio. Breaking Records. Breaking Records. Breaking Records Radio. Let's go. Breaking Records Radio. Breaking Records Radio. Breaking Records Radio. Breaking records, man. Radio is like the place to be. I don't fuck strange music, man. <laughs> yeah, because you guys, you guys had a very uh, original style too when you guys hit the scene. So I was kind of curious, like, with you, you know, saying you've always been into like the marketing and like you know that kind of side of things. Was that always kind of your vision, like you know the the, you, the way you guys swag? Well, 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 what it is is. It never was a meeting to say, hey, y'all, this how it's going to look. Yeah. You know? But what it is, is, is you do it so well and people look up to you in a certain way. Yeah. And it, it showed that they always been looking at me like that. So when I'm doing something, you know, I can do something small, like like when I wear two headbands. Yeah. And I cough them up. And then next thing you know, come out first, slow got on two headbands. Come out there next time, three people got on headbands. Come on, next time, five, all five got on headbands their own way, but it's two headbands. You know, I wear my jersey backwards. Then, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, then Nelly, you know what I'm saying? Then me and Nelly do it at the same time. Like, we should wear our jerseys backwards so you can see who, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And then next thing you know, everybody got them. So it was more of that. Like, even our routines that looked like a routine on stage, that, that didn't, that wasn't on rehearsal. That was just one or two people saying, or me saying, or somebody saying, oh, that was tight what you did right there. When that hook came on, that was dope. And then the next show, I'm going to stand next to him or somebody going to stand next to that person and do it with them. Not two people doing it. Yeah. Then them, then them two people will go around on both sides of a person that don't know what's going on, and they do it. Now he feels left out. So now tomorrow, he going to do it on that part. We don't even have to talk about it. Yeah. That's how we were. So to the point where we, like, I remember, I remember Buster Ryan said, y'all don't rehearse? He's like, no. He's like, man, like, y'all do it. He said, he's like, no, we just do that. He's like, you bullshit. <laughs> like, no, we just know. It's like organized confusion. You know what I mean? Or, or, or organized chaos. So it's kind of like, do what you want to do. And then when, that, when you hear them words right there, do this all together. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it looks like a whole lot of... You know, like we straight up be sitting in the living room rehearsing. Yeah. We special, man. As, as I look back, I just said, realize how special connection is and like knowing that you, it's okay to be Dirk Fisher and it's okay to be Dennis Rodman and it's okay to be Michael Jordan and it's okay to be Cartwright or a new boy. You know what I'm saying? It's okay to be these people. It's okay to be the coach. It's okay to be the owner. It's okay to be the customer sometimes. You know what I'm saying? So... Just knowing your part and knowing where you're in life in different situations, man, is 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 the blessing for real. Yeah, definitely. And like that's crazy that you guys never rehearse or anything. Even like your music videos. It's like I can almost tell the type of things you're talking about. Like, you know, like in the Midwest swing video, there's some of it and stuff, but like little like new like new movements you guys. Yeah, all that come from all that all it, it starts and it sometimes starts before the stage. It starts in the studio on playback. Yeah. And we just raise our hand like, oh, and then it'd be like, oh, my color's blue, and it stop. Keep it going, and then, you know what I'm saying, and we just develop it. Now, by the time you see it, she, it looks like coordination. Yeah. You know? Now, when we do a rehearsal, we might do a sound rehearsal. Yeah. You know, but we don't do, like, look at your hand like we don't do choreography rehearsals. You know what I'm saying? All that comes from mind and just being around each other so much. You know what I'm saying? That we just and we did so many shows, man. We was on the road like three three hundred and twenty days out of three sixty five. So 